I remember the day when me and my best friend, who had whipped cream all around her mouth and when we drank frothy hot chocolates, were laughing and clasping our best friend necklaces, promising that we'd always be together no matter what. Um, Sarah is a sweet, kind friend. She helps me do my homework as quick as a sports car. <laughs> She loves me as much as my family. <clears throat> I, I was walking outside on a really dark, cold night. I was terrified, with blood pumping like a rocket to my heart. And suddenly I stepped on the sheet of paper with dark corners and bright neon in the middle. I picked up the sheet and I realised it was a map. I carefully put it inside my violet backpack and then when I got home that night I took it out to have a look. I, I was trying to figure out where this mysterious place was. I stroked my finger along the map until the weirdest thing happened. It just started to rip and disappear. I, I tried to stretch it out to stop it but it didn't help. And then soon after I got a random phone call. I heard a weird voice saying that I needed to find the other half. But as soon as I ended the call, I immediately phoned the police. And they came as fast as a tornado. But because they wanted to know where the place was. They came armed with guns and they demanded that I give them the map. But I refused. I said that I would only show it to them and not give it away. They lifted their guns and aimed them at me, and then I just disappeared in a puff of smoke. And my mind was filled with thoughts of my life in the neighbourhood this year in 2030. Robots, electronic hands and gloves with automatic heaters. And then suddenly I was at Sarah's house. I told her all about the map and the police, and she let me sleep over her house. But then when I woke up, I was in the underground. I saw a shopping center as huge as a giant's foot and I went to explore the lovely place. There were bakeries that had the smell of freshly baked bread. And I, I stepped inside the beautiful bakery and I felt the bread. Oh, it, it was soft as a cloud and tasted delicious. I was just about to go and buy some clothes and I stepped outside of the bakery and, well, that's when the police ambushed me. Time's up.